Oh, hello. Hello, children. Um, I owe you a quick apology. I was going to lay down a new masterclass for you today. However, uh, I received a phone call from Mr. Evan Handler asking me to come and help him uh, prepare uh, for a new film, uh, which he has an audition for, Sharknado 17. He seems very excited about it, and I think probably a very good step up in his career if, from what I know of it. Um, so I'm not able to lay... it. You know what I'm going to do? I'm, going to, I'm just going to, I'm going to give you a very quick um, anecdote. Hans, please, just a moment. Uh, a very quick anecdote, because I care about you, because I care about your career. <coughs> I received a phone call um, uh, from Alvin uh, Pacino, um, a former student of mine, Alvin. Uh, well, only lets his best friends call him that. Anyhow, Alvin had gotten a call from Johnny Travolta asking me to work uh, with Mr. Handler. They were going to do a film together and wanted to know would I work with him. Well, he did. So I said, yes, of course, send, send the boy over. Uh, Mr. Handler comes over. Now, they, they were going to do a film about uh, O.J. Simpson. Poor O.J., poor, poor O.J., wonderful actor. And, you know, people say to me he was guilty, and I say, well, guilty of genius. In any event, here's Mr. Handler, and he does these uh, scenes from this movie about O.J., and I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what he is doing. I'm watching this travesty, and I think... You know, you're simply trying to to uh, shore up your flagging sexuality. That's what you're doing in the scenes. Your sexuality which is like a dog on an ice rink, frankly. Very strange. And I said, you stop! Stop it! Now listen to me! Listen to me, my boy! This is a real person! This is a real person! A great lawyer! Alan Durbelbang! I happen to know a little bit about Alan Durselvold, and, and it's important! It's important you play him with dignity! You've got to do some research! Open a book, for God's sakes! Do a little bit of reading, B.D. Wong! You have to prepare! It's important! I made that noise. Now, do you have any, any idea how, how upset I have to be to make a noise like that? Well... Mr. Handler was hurt. He was wounded. He was like a, a little bird. But he submerged his ego. And I have to tell you, at the end of the day, he was quite, quite good. And so, today, I am prepared to allow Mr. Handler into the pantheon of my former students, Alvin Pacino and Fabio. Congratulations, Mr. Handler!